All right, hello and welcome, guys. Uh, this is um, a little interesting series I'm think was thinking about doing for a little while. Um, it's the single-player Tarkov mod. So, um, if you don't know what that is, it's a mod, obviously, made for free by some very talented people that lets you play Tarkov in a PvE-only experience. Um, I've, I don't know anything about it. I've never played it before. This would be my first time playing it. <clears throat> Excuse me. I've heard great things about it. I've heard it's great fun. Um, it's actually an enjoyable Tarkov experience. Uh, not to say live Tarkov is unenjoyable. It's just, uh, more of the good stuff, you know, if you know what I mean. Um, so yeah, we're going to give it a shot. Um, yeah, I don't know how else to intro this, um. I don't know if this will be a regular series. We'll see if you guys like it. Um, just uh, doing this as a little filler in between the animated videos I make. So uh, yeah, hope you like it. Let's uh, dive in. This is gonna be a zero to hero run, which means we will start with nothing in our stash, in our hideout, nothing, absolutely nothing. And uh, yeah, we're gonna have to zero to hero it. So let's see how we can do. I'm not a Tarkov expert. I'm not a pro or anything. So this is basically Tarkov Noob Plays PvE, I guess. Uh, so yeah, our username is going to be Zone Operator, obviously. ZTH, Zero Hero. Obviously we're going to pick USEC, that's a given, right? Like, why would you even want to play Bear? Yeah, we're going to be USEC. Um, I do have cosmetic mods installed that let you be anybody. So you can look like anybody, you can take anybody's cosmetics, like I can look like, uh, you can look like Big Pipe, look like Bird Eye, look like Knight, Gluar, you can look like everybody pretty much. I think we'll take a standard USEC face, I don't know if I want to take, oh goodness, Rachala. Empty. Cultists. Like I said, I, I haven't played this at all yet, so I don't know what any of this looks like. Oh my goodness, that's a that's a great face. We might take the Sig Scav. Oh god. Ooh, that's good too. I don't e I don't even know what I want to take now. This is so new and fresh. I I don't even know what I want. Man, that's a standard USEC face. Oh, Hudson, that's standard, yeah. Zarachi. Tequila. I think we're gonna take a standard USEC face. I feel like a standard USEC face is the way to go. Yeah, that looks good. All right, voice. Oh yeah, all the voices are here. Like I got a bad feeling about this. Ребят, погнали на другую точку. Ah, Rashala's voice. That might be a little confusing if I had to fight Rashala. Да я вижу тебя, вижу. Замри. Ходу, ходу, ходу. I love Sanitar's voice actor. Sanitar's voice actor just goes for it. He really gave it his all. Um, I'll take a USEC voice. So, what do we got here? Like in the movie? I got a bad feeling about this. Ah, oh, never mind. I gotta stay focused. Better sweep your sectors. You better worry about bears. It's true. The hell was that? Let's go further. It's a good day. Jeez, Bird Eye and Knight don't have very many voice lines. Um, yeah, I think I usually go with like Chris or Josh or somebody. What the fuck am I doing here? I can't believe Command just up and left us here. Never mind, we still got work to do. No way, man. Never mind, we still got work to do. What's up over there? I'm gonna take Chris. What the fuck am I doing here? Yeah. 
All right, Yusek, let's go. Let's do it. That was a little, a little much in the cosmetics. Okay, let's take a look at what we got here. Character, obviously we have nothing. This is a zero to hero run. No money, no gear, no bitches. Uh, oh, we have a knife. Let's go. And just alpha container, no epsilon. Uh, I don't, uh, should be nothing in here. So obviously, nothing here in the hideout. Nothing built, nothing created, except obviously the level one stash. Okay, let's um, let's um, let's go to the traders and let's. Um, I'm gonna examine these items. I'll edit this out and uh, I'll come back when I'm level two. Okay, we've hit level two, uh, so we can do introduction. Let's get our tasks. Should do debut. Eliminate scavs, MP-133 shotguns, shortages, Salewa. Uh, so mechanic doesn't give you a level two. Maybe, I think you have to complete debut, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, so, mercenary work. Uh, obviously, we don't have anything. Um, I believe, yeah, fence offers clothing instead of brag, man. And he, he offers all the clothing. It's all but unlocked. The scav outfits, the boss outfits, you know, so uh, we might be, we might be dripping pretty heavy uh, late game, so... Yeah, we need the levels and money and stuff like that. So we'll see what we can do. So obviously there's uh, nothing to do for it. We just have to jump in. We have no weapons, obviously. We're not going to be doing scav runs. It's going to be PMCs only in Zero to Hero. Um, yeah, so we need to get in there and find a weapon. Where would be the best place to find a weapon? Customs is a pretty map I'm pretty familiar with. A lot of weapon boxes on customs. There will be um, AI enemies, obviously, and AI PMCs decked out on the map. Um, I wonder if I do I change that in settings at all, or no, I don't know. I don't know how it works. Let's just jump in. Let's just jump into a raid. Uh, 3 p.m. Sounds good. Oh, here we go. Uh, Yeah, bosses, yeah. Scavor. 
I don't know what this, I don't know what scav war is. Maybe scavs kill each other? Practice mode settings. Wait, what? Hang on. In this mode, you can practice offline on your own or immerse yourself in an online company. Wait, what? I don't, I don't want to do practice mode. How do I do regular mode? How do I turn how do I turn this off? Um okay, I'll be right back. I'm gonna see if I can turn this off. I don't want to do a practice mode. Give me a sec, guys. I'll be I'll be back in a second. Okay, I've alright guys. I've looked into it. I think uh like this practice mode, quote unquote, is how the game is supposed to run, so Okay, I think uh, I think this is how it's supposed to run. So we'll just do our settings here. Um, weather, blah blah blah. Bosses, online, online, not tagged and cursed, no scav war. Okay. Okay. Uh, yes, we have nothing, nothing to ensure. Let's uh, let's go. Okay, so um, this is our first raid here. Let's see how this goes. Hopefully, this is what we want. Um, yeah. Obviously, objective one is finding a weapon of some sort. Maybe the AI P PMCs will kill the scams and I can pick something up, or vice versa. VoIP is unavailable. Cool. Wasn't planning on VoIPing the AI anyway. Um. Yeah. We'll see how this goes, guys. I'm a little excited to see how this goes. Look at this. No load times. Just quick into the raid. No five minutes looking for a server. It's fantastic. Okay, where am I? Raid number one, customs. Okay, we're by this place. All right, we gotta find a weapon beyond our knife. Let's check the stashes. Can of herring, let's go. Let's go, we got a hat. We're already, already running it. All right, there's weapon boxes in here. I don't think all the AI spawn right away, so I think we're okay for a minute or two, but obviously any weapon is gold here. Rubles, I will put that up my ass. Um, obviously not every raid is gonna be an action-packed big raid. If we have uneventful raids later down the road, I might just uh, edit them out. But uh, these first few raids, I'm going to keep in full. Uh, just to let you guys know what it's like. Ooh, 556 five, suppressor. I do kind of want that, but I need a gun right now. Need a gun. I mean, I could try to kill a scav with a knife, but I doubt that's going to go anywhere. There are more stashes over yonder than I could find. Oh, come on, weapon. Weapon. Yes. Yes. We are in a business, boys. 7.62. PS ammo, obviously. Couldn't get any good stuff. An STM with no mat, or no sight, I mean. 20 rounds of that. Okay, we're in business. Let's try to find some gear. Try to find some MP133s. Let's go, guys. We are rocking. Good start. Two guns just like that. No sniper scam on top of the warehouse. I am excited. I'm actually... It might sound like I'm shitting on the original game, but I'm actually excited to play this. I think we're going to have a lot of fun doing this. Tonkar was a great game, it's a great experience, but just, uh, online is not, oh, A, the most reliable service in the world, and B, sometimes it can feel a little, ooh, morphine, that's good, sometimes it can be a little demoralizing to play online, let's say, let's say that. 
BBE, I'm, I hear good things. I hear a lot of good things. A lot of great reviews. A lot of people saying it's the... the Swear to God, I just heard a, a flashlight click. Am I tripping? Yeah, maybe I'm tripping. But, um, what was I saying? Yeah, I hear good things. Okay, good. Drink. And okay, shattered mask. Sure. And uh, like I said, I've never played this before. I have no idea what it is, how it plays, what the AI is like. I don't know anything about this. This is totally blind, 100% unknown. I'm just diving in, essentially. We need this measuring tape for the hideout. Ooh, hose. Take that, too. Hoses are always good. I don't, apparently the flea market works somehow. Don't know how that works. Yeah, I can't, uh, can't really say it enough. I have no idea how, th how this works. I just thought it'd be fun. Just some fun series to make. And like I said, it's, it's PvE, essentially offline raids. So we can just do whatever. We can just have as much fun as we want. Just have a good time. SSD drive. Okay, I can't get burdened down with late game junk. I just gotta look for the essentials, look for the early game gear. I can't be thinking about late game stuff. Let's just let's just do that. Let's just grind this out. These first few raids. These first few raids might not be very exciting. I might not oh, what's this? Yoitota. Isn't that a key? You're on customs. I don't know. I'm not going to take it, though. I believe that key is here on customs, but I don't recall exactly. Damn, it's some random stuff. Okay. Taking all bets right now. First raid... Survive or die? Ooh. I think I just heard someone check their mag. There might be scabs outside. We will find out. Oh, horsey? Oh, there's sniper scab over there. Right? That's that's him. In that case, I will crouch. I haven't heard any any action yet. I don't know if the, the AIs are spawning or, or what. No, sh no shots, no gunfire. I might I might sound like a broken record here, but like I said, this is total zero experience. I don't know what this is going to be like. I don't know if this practice raid is like just a non raid, but. I'm excited to find out. Dolly G whiz a bag would be super nice. You know, ironically, a uh, oh wow, is this a gold skull ring? Wow. Um. Um. There you go. Drink one drink. Metabolism. Boom. Yeah, I don't know what this is going to be like. I don't know if this is just like a free raid or what, so... The learning experience for everyone, as they say. Oh, that sound difference is crazy. I'm starting to wonder if that was sniper scam I saw on the roof. Cause I, I don't hear anything. I don't know. I don't know if there's any action going on. Are there AI on the map? You know what I mean. 
I do feel like at any moment I could just be shot in the head, though. Oh no, I see a sniper scab there in the tower. Okay, so the enemy AI does exist. They are here. Ah. Still a Oh, sniper scab is coming down here. He's running away. That might be a regular scab. I don't think sniper scab leaves the tower, right? Let's go get him, though. Could be our first kill or our first death. Where the hell did he go? He's gone. Where the hell did he actually go? Crouching tiger, hidden scav. Oh, I'm nervous. That nervous feeling is creeping in again. What the fuck? Pardon my language, but the uh, scab appears to have disappeared. Well, um, we saw our, a scav. I don't know where he's gone, though. And now I'm a little afraid. He has outright disappeared. Uh, this is a little dangerous. Oh, what a shot. There we go. First kill. Let's go. Uh, don't need that SKS. I'll take the rig, though. So it was a sniper scav. I didn't realize sniper scavs could run out of the tower. Maybe it behaves differently in uh, offline raids. I don't know. Okay, we got a rig. We have... Oh, wait. No, no, no. What am I doing? Uh, can I find that again? Yeah, I have a 7.62 gun. Here we go. Now we're thinking. Now we're thinking with portals. Okay, so we did it. First kill in the books. Not bad, not bad. I wonder if that was a headshot. He died to one shot. Look at that. Very exciting. All right, let's hit the stash over here. Maybe there can be a tool bag or something in here. Maybe a helmet, maybe a headset, you know, who knows? Oh, we got something. Oh, CSA rig. Helmet, let's go. Uh, the CSA rig is better, right? Oh yeah, big time. Fly scab vest, little CSA rig. Uh, shattered mask. Yeah, we don't want that. I'll take the helmet. Let's go. All right, I'm ready to extract. <laughs> uh, you know, let's take the L and or take the W. I mean, not don't take the L. Let's see what else we can find. Who knows what it's in here? Oh, is this Amelia's? Yes. We're gonna need those for Jaeger when we find him. That is a 7.62 mag. Is that the good ammo? That's nah, just FMJ. All right, get rid of that. Ooh, that's a good buttstock, actually. Yeah, like I said, guys, let me know. Let me know if you like this series. Let me know your thoughts. Everything. Let me know about the quality. Is the sound too quiet? Is the in-game sound too quiet? Am I too loud? 
Let me know everything. I'll tune. I'll fix everything as you guys let me know. And obviously, let me know if you want to see more. Obviously, my channel is stalker related, but uh, EFT, stalker, it's all sort of the same atmosphere as they say. So, another hot rod, yeah. Bolts. Bolts are always good. Those are never bad investments. Did I hit that stash over there? I don't think I did. Let's hit that stash. What are our extracts? RUAF. Okay. Let's make our way to, our, to the RUAF. Check the old gas. See what's going on there. This raid isn't really about crazy loot, obviously. It's about guns. It's about gear. It's about bags, rigs, etc. Ooh, armor, maybe? What's this? PCU? Yes, armor. Okay, here we go, guys. Armor, guns. Feeling kind of good here, guys. Feeling kind of good. I don't know if the AI PMCs are here. I don't know if those are here. I don't know what the deal is with that. I've heard there are AI PMCs. Is that real? I don't know. We will find out. Maybe they are, maybe they aren't. You know, when you have no equipment weighing you down, you can actually run pretty fast. It's one thing you always forget about when you're playing Tarkov and you're always super geared. Slower run speed. Oh! Saw someone. What is that? Scav. Where are you going? You going around? Oh. How exciting. It's like watching a nature documentary. I'm like, ah, oh, ah. Oh, I see him. He's all the way over there. He almost looks like an uh like a player scav. That's crazy. I wonder if that is like a quote unquote player scav. This is so awesome. I'm talking a little much. It's just to just to keep you guys entertained, as as they say. I don't want there to be too much dead silence. All right, where is this cam that was out here? I don't know how absolutely cracked the AI is going to be in this. Oh my goodness. That was a moment. Yeah, I don't know how cracked the AI is going to be. So I'm just sort of taking it cautiously. I don't want them to just open head eyes me. What's the diaper helmet? Nice. Oh, the AR-15 CQC stock. I don't need water filters, I'm going to take... Obviously, anyone who's played a lot of live Tarkov knows the AI can be pretty... pretty head eyes -y from time to time. I don't know how they're going to be here. Cigarettes, don't need those for bad habits yet. Alright, let's see if we can find that second scab. That first scab kind of scared the shit out of me. But Escape from Tarkov, much like Stalker, is first and foremost a horror game. A lot of people don't know that. Oh, I see him. He's way over there. This might be risky. No sniper scabs that I can see. Saw him go back here, but I don't see his feet. Oh, there he is. <laughs> this is cool. This is really cool. 
We just got a bag. Let's go. Got a mask. MP153, not exactly the shotgun we want. A better rig. Meds, Vaseline, a grenade. Where? Who was it and how am I not dead? Is that a sniper scav? It's the regular scav. I'm looking up high for a sniper scab, but I don't see him. Well, there he is. Taking risks here. <laughs> this is crazy. I'm like, I'm actually having fun. This is crazy. I'm actually kind of enjoying myself. Yepka. I got a pestily mask on? No, oh, he's got a... Just a regular gas mask. Wilson cigarettes. Morphine. Can of Sprats, I think. Yeah. The AK-55, the same mag I'm using? Yeah, it is. No, this is 762 ammo. I thought this was uh, a thing, but uh, I guess it's not. Got in your bag. What's this? Store safe key? Don't know what that is. Don't know if it's good. Don't know if it's bad. Oh! I hear gunshots in the distance. How unbelievably exciting. This is like... You know what? You know what that means? Gunfire in the distance. That means an AI PMC is fighting an AI scav. That is awesome. This is like. This might. This may be. This very well may be the coolest mod I've ever played. There's no way that's at me, right? How do I organize this? I need to eat, so we'll do that. Let's do it. Four. Five. That. I'm not going to take the shotgun. Let's loot the scab over here that I checked, or killed, not checked. And then I think. Where? Where? How? Once again, I, I don't think that's at me. I think that's another AI scav fighting a player. Wow, these scavs are stacked with grenades and meds and stuff. It's actually kind of crazy. Crickets. We're going to need those, but I'm not going to worry about them right now. Man, his bag is full of loot. What is going on here? These scabs are carrying more stuff than they ever carried in game. Alright, he didn't really have anything I needed. Let's move on. Let's go find a safe harbor. Check our mags. Let's check warehouse four here. Yeah, guys, uh, please, like I said, and like I've said too many times already, please let me know. Wow, it's dark in here. Let me know what you think of the series. All that good stuff. I'm already having fun. We're we're 20 minutes into the first raid. I'm already having a great time. I haven't been randomly head eyes by a scav. That's always cool. 
Now, this guy fired a few shots, so one of these mags has to have low ammo, right? Probably the one I took out of the gun would make sense. Yeah. Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to do this. Unload the ammo from this mag and then ditch this mag so I have a free slot so I don't drop a mag if I reload. Cool. Now we check underground. You know, in the... Oh my god, it's dark. Now, um... Flashlight would be super cool right about now. Obviously, one of the things is that the AI doesn't behave like players, so they can be anywhere. They can be in this basement. They could be at the player hotspots. You know, that's really the cool thing. You know, don't know what to expect. I've said it a hundred times already. I don't know what to expect. This is totally blind. Obviously, I've played like live Tarkov, but this offline mod type of situation, I've no experience with. Don't know what it's going to be like. I have literally no idea. Lots of med tools. No Silewa hanging around. All right. There is a weapon crate up here. I'm going to check before I go. This door is open. Interesting. All the doors seem to be open. The AI might just wander through these places. this BT ammo? God damn. Kill him here. What's this? Tactical device. I put that on there. Uh, or FMJ. I kind of want this 556 five, suppressor, but I don't even have the mount for it. 9x21. Yeah, I don't need that. I say 58 folding stock, don't need that, okay. Let's move on, let's head to the gas station, let's try and make our way to our UAF here. We got a lot, we got good loot, good gear for this first raid, let's, um, let's try and skedaddle here. Take the W, exfil. I'm not gonna say don't die, because that's just gonna jinx it. So we're just gonna... Gonna play this out. Looks like we got AI scams roaming around. And still, bro. Alright, let's go down under. There's more cover approaching this way. Whoa! I just sharp myself. Let's see. No idea where this guy is. I think he's in like the bushes somewhere. I should make him run away. What the? F what the freak? This guy is insane. I just cannot get an angle on this guy. There he is. My aim is horrible. Oh! Did he just shoot me? Yeah, he did. What a beast. Jesus. Got AI versus a dog shit Tarkov player. The match of the century right here. Could just try and bypass like a like a biatch. But I think I have to kill him. He wounded me, I have to kill him. Boom. I mean, yeah, sure, I can make a running headshot like that, but from a distance with a stable firing position, I can't hit shit. I think this guy had a one one five three. Four? Oh no, one five five. Okay. Alright. Well played. Well played, sir. I oh, was using slugs. 
Maybe he hit me with a ricochet. Wouldn't that be interesting? Do I want Anglin? Anglin painkillers are not that good. Just saw him. Where did he go? That's like the terrifying thing about Tarkov is when like scabs disappear on you. You just have no idea where they went. Like earlier when that scab, we saw him and then he just like ran away somewhere and we had no idea where he went. Kind of like now, I just saw that guy and now I have literally no idea where he went. These scabs are insane ninjas. Did not drop the mag. Good. I feel like he's just crouched in a really obvious area. And I just don't see him. You know, I'm not going to fuck around with him too much. I think I'm just going to leave. I think I'm just going to depart the area. Do I have old gas? Can I get out here? No, i got to make it to our UAF. So scared that he's just like in a bush now. Waiting to absolutely beat the shit out of me. Alright, let's just circle around Fortress. Don't really need to go in there. What's our timer looking like? God damn. We've been here forever. <laughs> My hands are cold. It's winter. GPU. Ooh, ibuprofen painkillers. Vitamins. We need all this. Oh my god. Okay. I didn't want to drink the water, but I'm drinking the water. You know, the Vaseline can stay. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Under 10 minutes, let's hustle. Let's hit these few stashes, let's get to the extract and get out of here. Or, let's not, let's, uh, let's die. Oh my god, is it the goons? Are you kidding me? What the freak? I'm gonna die, I'm dead. Oh my god. It was the freaking goons, man. First raid and I find the goons. Unreal. Is the I hope the boss spawner isn't 100%. That's all I'm going to say. Oh my god. What the hell is this name? I have no idea. Oh, that first scab we killed was a sniper scab. Okay, interesting. I killed Big Pipe. How interesting is that? Wow, that was a cool raid. That was really fun. I mean, kind of a crap ending running into the goons like that, but... Really awesome, actually. This is fun as hell. Bang, level 3. I mean, with BCP, FMJ, he probably had his black MDR. Um, do I want to use... Yeah, we'll use that. I'm not going to make it too hardcore. I don't want to punish myself. We're having a good time. Wow, super exciting. God, that was going so good, too, when I run into the goons like that. Yeah. That's brutal. I think we run that back, to be honest. I think we run customs again. So like, okay, so bosses are here, it's just that, like, I, like, I just wonder if they are, like, 100% spawn rates, you know what I mean? I wonder if they're going to be there every raid. This is going to be so much fun. 
I think I might just turn this into a series, regardless if it's, if it's popular on my channel or not. This is so much fun. I'm actually enjoying playing Tarkov. Like, I'm enjoying it. I'm not worrying about cheaters. I'm not worrying about invisible players or silent footsteps or any of that stuff. I'm not worried at all. Like, it just doesn't, it doesn't matter, right? Look at this. No load times. I'm not worried about being kicked out of a game for, like, bad latency or the server's unavailable. I just hop right in. This will be a little bit of a test, though. This will be a little bit of a test if the goons are there all the time. I'm, I'm going to go construction again. Might be a little risky. Or, I mean, fortress again, not construction. I'm going to go fortress again. And if the goons are there, then we might turn off the bosses for now. body oh. oh my god please have mercy offer five ps don't care A dead scav the pmc ai has been through here oh my god please give me everything saiga i'll take it gas mask Come on, come on. Okay, quick retreat. Ooh, super performance slugs. Actually, not bad. Super performance slugs can turn shotguns into friggin' sniper rifles. What is this? Tactical device? Cool. Okay, mag. Morphine again. Grenades, let's go. Grenades, let's go. Chunk. They're all full mags, right? Cool. Okay. I'm I'm happy to leave. <laughs> Old gas. Alright, let's do the same route. We could die. We could not. I just wanna, I wanna head to Fortress again to see if the goons will be there every time. Like, what is there just gonna be a 100% spawn rate? I don't think that's the case. I think they spawn kind of the same as they do in live Tarkov. It's just, I just wanna see. I think that scab actually bled out, ironically. There's nobody on the heavy machine gun. I'm seeing a lot of blood here. It's a little, little worrying. Ooh, what is with this sight? It's like off center. What is going on with that? Hang on a sec. That 
That's a little weird. That make it a little hard to aim. Now I'm nervous. It's like now I've got gear again. Now I'm nervous again. This could be a mistake. Be a lot of scabs in here. I heard somebody on the machine gun. I wonder if that was an AI. Because AI can use the machine guns, right? I just wonder. This is like a totally new experience. This is totally fresh. And I am loving it. I mean, this aim down sight's a little weird, but I feel like we can make it work. Making it work. All right, I'm not going to waste my time here. I want to check construction, and if there's the goons aren't there, if we prove my theory that they don't spawn 100%, I would just like to leave with the gear. Just leave with some gear. Call that episode one. Break out the champagne. There's a stash over here. We'll check that. Slewa? Maybe? Am I that lucky? Psych? So how are you guys doing today? Nuts and bolts, always good to have. If you guys play live Tarkov, nuts and bolts are never a bad item to pick up. Um, let me just do this real quick. Just want to see what ammo is in here. 300 blackout, get out of here. It's going to be a long time before I'm using a 300 blackout gun. I mean, actually, I don't really know. All right, no one, no one is shouting. We got a bandit. We'll see if we just fall over dead here. I am actually going to check the forest, or the forest, Jesus. Fortress. I'm going to check for goons. I, I want to know, was I just incredibly unlucky, or did they just spawn here all the time? Yeah, I don't hear anything. Don't hear any footsteps, don't hear any shouting. Ah. Yepka, you have an ass. Okay, they don't spawn here every time. They would have killed the scabs if they were here. Awesome. Wow, what is this? What is this stuff? Can't take that. Sanitar 309 key? What the? What the freak? What is this? What the bleep? Any bleep? Can I fit this in here, by the way? Should be able to. It'd be a bad idea doing all this while I'm. There's another scab on the loose, but. Flashlight on his gun was on. No way. I hear the goons again. I hear them shouting. I heard cease fire. Unless that's a freaking AI PMC. I'm gonna get the freak out of here. No, 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 no. No way. Well, I'll 
I'll tell you this, they don't shoot like the AI. I would have been dead there if that was really them. Um, I'm gonna bust this real quick. Come on, let me out of here. No. Jeez. Who is that? Is that a PMC or the goons? Okay, it was the goons. Alright, so they have 100% spawn, so we're gonna, like, we're gonna turn that down. We're gonna turn them off, I think. Okay. Damn. Okay. Now we know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to fix that. I'm gonna have to change the settings. Okay. <sighs> Well, those were the first two raids, guys. First two raids. Two killed in actions. Uh, yeah, that's uh, that's tough. That was tough. Not much we can do there. Ran into the goons twice. So we're going to have to turn off their spawn rate or turn it down or, or something. Okay, this has been the first episode, guys. Um, if you want me to turn this into a series, let me know. Um, yeah, I don't never know how to end these things. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't for more content. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Have a nice day.